hello, hello. How is everyone doing tonight? Hello, hello. I'm gonna invite a couple people really quick. Okay, so just invited a couple of people. Let's see. you are hopping on hi melody um new background um i decided the boys are out in the living room this evening playing video games so instead of being live in the kitchen i decided to go live in my room so not much of a background it's just a plain wall but i haven't gotten no pictures or anything hung up yet i'm trying to figure out which wall i want to create um my personal jewelry space on that the babies wouldn't be able to get to it and rip it down so I kind of haven't done much with the walls <laughs> um, we're still trying to figure all that out and so I hope everyone is having a good night um, I know that I have had to postpone and change a couple lives around um, just because of crazy things <laughs> um, so between not feeling good and then lawyer getting a hold of me again yeah, but we are here tonight. I am back with you guys. So, um, I've got some newer pieces to show you guys and some vintage pieces for you guys tonight as well. If you guys are hopping on, say hello so I know that you're here. If we are not friends, hi Lacey. Um, on Facebook, it doesn't always show me that you guys are tuning in. So when you guys say hello, then I know that you're here. Um, feel free to share this over to your personal timelines and invite some of your other friends to join in with us okay and I will get started I hope you all got your favorite drink I got music in the background but it's a little bit lower this time I do not own the rights to any of the music it is off of a personal playlist of mine so hopefully it won't silence my video like it did on my frozen live we'll work with it we will see so, let me get a drink of this and we'll get right back into it here. Okay. Some little number cards. Wow, my screen's going to like want to move around and my light's going to want to adjust funny. I don't like when it does that. Hello, hello. I'm hoping that where I got to go a little bit, um live a little bit earlier tonight that more people will be able to tune in. I know my last couple of lives they've been a little bit later and during the week that might be a little bit rough for some people to tune into so hopefully tonight will be a little bit better. Okay so first up this is a new piece. This is one of the pieces that I offered to my VIPs first. Thank you Lacey. Um, this is called To Love and Adore. This is one of our new Valentine's Day pieces that we just got. It is a clasp style bracelet. It has a two inch extender, so this could be worn as an anklet as well. Okay, let me get this to go back this way. It is one bracelet, but it has three different layers. 
you have the twisted style chain on the first layer. A normal smaller link chain is the second bracelet. And then on the third layer, you have the silver tube beads with the little pink heart beads that go around. Okay. I don't want that closer. Super cute bracelet. This one will fit larger or smaller wrists since it is a clasp. Okay. I would make a very pretty gift for Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is next month. It would make a cute birthday present or just an I'm thinking about you gift, anything like that. Okay. Five dollars for that. Okay. Again, my invoicing is done on Sundays. I invoice through PayPal. My shipping is one, two, four items is $3.50. Five items and up is a flat rate of $5.95. Kids pieces are flat rate $2 because they just don't weigh as much. Um, and I will mail out on Mondays as long as post office is open and invoices are paid. Okay, for those of you who know me and those of you who don't, I am Julia. You are tuning in to Wild Prairie Bling. I am an independent consultant for paparazzi. I am coming up on my third pop anniversary in May. So tonight we are looking at adult pieces of jewelry. Everything is lead and nickel free and $5. Okay, so again, that's that piece. This piece will be number eight. I have one available of it. Number eight for the little heart bracelet. That's what I was looking for. Okay, so number eight for that bracelet. Okay, to claim something that you like, you simply comment sold with the number of the piece that I'm showing. As long as you are seeing that red button live, then the numbers will be with the jewelry that I showed tonight. After the live is over, the numbers go away. I do not keep the numbers. Hello, sis. Um, with the pieces after I'm live because everything goes back in its own little containers and storage space okay um, so if you catch the replay and you see something that you like you can just screenshot a picture of the piece that you like and um, message it to me and I can get it marked down for you okay so number eight for the little pink heart Valentine's bracelet one available of those what is everybody up to tonight I'm just kind of hanging out, letting the boys play their video games. Okay. Uh -huh. How is your night going, sis? this next piece is a vintage piece this is called rainbow shine I do have this available in green as well this is a double layer necklace it is a shorter necklace okay. you have these silver fish hook earrings you have the blue with the like smoky there we go. Kind of like the smoky inner part. Okay. You have the two chains. It has the lobster claw hook with the two inch extender. Okay. First layer. You have the little blue round bead. Kind of like an oval. Super light blue. Almost a clear bluish bead. You have the silver flat beads. And then back into the oval blue smoky beads that match the earring. And those come all the way 
down along both chains of the necklace. Okay, so as a double layer, that is going to sit just like that. Okay. Very pretty. This works for an everyday piece. You can wear it to dress up or dress down. That's where the earrings would sit. Okay. Like I said, I do have that one in green as well. This one will be number five. Number five for the rainbow shine in blue. Being shepherd's pie and watching Masked Dancer. Oh, I haven't had shepherd's pie in a long time. That sounds good. I need to make that one of these nights. Okay, so number five for that necklace. I gotta quit putting that thing in front of me like that. Number five for that necklace. Everything is tax free. If you are local to the Rollins area, then you can either pick up anything claimed or I can deliver it to you for free. So that's kind of a little perk of being in the Rollins area. What are you and Jade up to, sis? How's your night going, Melody? Next we have Cool Cascade. This is another blue necklace. This one is so pretty, you guys. This is I really like this necklace a lot. Okay. Fighting her to eat her thing, mac and cheese. That's crazy because that child loves mac and cheese. Okay, silver fish hook earrings, and you kind of have like the periwinkle blue bead. Thicker silver chain, two inch extender with the lobster claw hook. And it's going to come down into all these pretty dangles. And you have the silver spacer beads with the clear blue cylinder beads. Down into a silver hoop and back into the periwinkle blue beads that dangle along the neckline there. Very pretty piece. So this one is on its very shortest setting so you can make this one a little bit longer if you like this one on is going to sit just about like that okay very pretty the way it cascades and lines along the neckline okay. this one is going to be number 89 89 for the cool cascade blue necklace i have one available of it so it is a one and done definitely like my lighting from the kitchen better. Okay, so number 89 for the Cool Cascade Blue Necklace. Okay, kind of get it up close there so you can see the detail in the beading and the chain. Number 89 for that one, one available. Yeah, um, Talking tattoo ideas for matching tattoos with Alyssa and Susie. That's cool. Um, yeah, my money got delayed with my card, so um, I have to wait for it to hit so that way Hulu can come out. Stupid thing. It, it, it should have been on my card today. I don't know why it's not. It drives me nuts when it does that. Or else I would have been active today, too. So it kind of dampered my plans here just a little bit. Okay, this is another brand new piece that I just got in. This is a blue
necklace. It's kind of like the moonstone setting. Okay, this is called One Can Only Gleam. It is a shorter necklace, silver chain, two inch extender, lobster claw back. You have the silver fish hook earrings with the darker moonstone blue beads. Okay, and then down onto the silver chain, you have the line of blue, deeper blue moonstones, okay, that are framed in the silver roped framework there. Okay, this is a shorter necklace, so on this one's going to sit just about like that. Very gorgeous necklace. I love the deep coloration of the blue for the stones. Okay. I haven't heard much about that show, so I'm not sure. Okay. This is the only one I have left available in it. So just the one available for that. This one will be number 90. Number 90 for that necklace. Number 90. Again, if you hear the paper crinkling, that is because everything stays in its individual packaging. So I pull it out when I show it and then it gets put back in its packaging to keep it clean and dust free and safe from getting broke. It's about the nurses rather than the doctors. Oh, okay, maybe I did hear a little bit about that. Um, okay, up next I have this purple next necklace. It's called Traveling Trend Setter. It is a vintage necklace. It is a one and done. Okay, it, this one is a larger silver chain. You have the silver fish hook earrings with the deep plum purple beaded earrings, lobster claw hook, two inch extender, large silver link chain, and it comes down and on each layer you have a mixture of silver and plum purple beads and then you have the honeycomb teardrop beads that dangle from that in silver. Okay. So on the neckline that's going to sit just about like that. You can make it a little bit longer if you'd like. Okay, Very pretty purple piece. Okay. That's called Traveling Trend Center in purple. That, oh, that will be number four. Again, that is a vintage piece. This is a one and done. Number, oops, let me get that to fit better. What is it doing? You're telling me to be difficult. Okay, so number four for the purple and silver necklace very pretty necklace that one's good for an everyday piece to dress up a really pretty outfit that's purple or something for work or just for casual okay number four for that one that's that plum purple okay 
one of those available. So, okay, it says, so I was trying the um, live um, shopping feature thing that they have for the live videos now, and as soon as my camera flipped to this way instead of it staying straight up it like booted it off of that feature so I don't know trying to get that feature figured out has been giving me fits and kind of driving me nuts <laughs> I'm like how can I get this to work okay. Okay, so, and I also have the um, Traveling Trendsetter Necklace in pink. So I have one available in purple and one available in pink. Do I have more than one? Okay. So one available in purple and one available in pink. That is the same necklace, just with the pink beading okay so if you like either one of those you can comment number four purple or number four pink okay number four purple or number four pink Those are really cute necklaces. I like those. I like the way that they lay along the neckline. Okay, this one is called Waves of Purple. This is another vintage necklace. This one is a multi-layered chain necklace. This is your deep violet purple. Okay. Has the lobster claw hook with the two inch extender. It is on its shortest setting right now. Right. Okay. Deep violet purple beaded earrings on the silver fish hooks comes down and you have three, four different layers of chains. Your main connecting chain is a little bit larger. Your first chain here is smaller silver chain and you have it where it lines at the bottom with all the dark violet purple beads in that layer. Then you have a medium plain chain that dangles in between that. And then on the third layer, you have the silver flowery beads holding the dark plum. Yeah, I thought they had some crackle tomb for a second there, but they kind of have like a speckling look kind of. Okay, dark plum, or yeah, dark violet purple beads there. And then the last chain that hangs is a larger silver chain. So they lay just like that. Okay. On the neckline, it is going to layer and sit just like this. Okay. You can make it a little bit longer if you want, so you could have it dangle further down if you'd like to where it would sit more like that. Okay. I have one available of those. one available of those that necklace will be number 72 number 72 for that one and that was called waves of purple necklace
been on a Linkin Park kick today. I've been listening to Linkin Park a lot today. Hmm, I was looking at that too, and it needed you to post items that are available. So it in real time, and then there's no lag on oh, on anything, and they can rewind and whatnot while live, which is cool. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play around with that some more and figure it out. I noticed that it wanted you to um like add things from the shop. I don't know. I've been trying to mess around with the shop feature too, so I've been playing around with lots of new things and branching out to um. Expanding to newer features and platforms as well. So it's kind of been an adventurous month with all of that so far. Up next, I have this pink necklace. It is called Modern Macarena. It is another vintage necklace. I have two of these available. So these ones are fun to stack in double layer. Silver fish hook earrings, bright pink cone shaped bead, thick silver chain, there's that two inch extender, comes down and you have the little circular like honeycomb pink beads and then it goes into like the teardrop or cone style ones that dangle all along the neckline. Okay, that bright pink on the neckline, that's how that's gonna set. You can make it a little bit longer I do have two available in it. That one's going to be number 41. That's the modern Macarena pink necklace. And I've got it sitting all crooked. Okay. Okay, I have two available in it. Okay. Again, very pretty for every day. You can also dress it up. Or dress it down. Okay, number 41 for that one. Ah, <laughs> Sawyer's so all out in the hallway. Brum, brum, brum. He's all making car noises. <laughs> Up next is another brand new pair of earrings that was just released. I have one pair of these available. These are called C. La Vie. They are a purple wood earring. Very lightweight. a lot that my son used to listen to all the time when me and my um, first husband was going through our separation and stuff so okay so those are those vibrant violet purple wood earrings we have the designs cut out there I have a pair of these for myself I have not gotten to wear them yet I'm excited to though okay very lightweight very gorgeous these will be a beautiful spring and summertime piece with a maxi or, um, dress or little springtime dress. Very gorgeous earrings. Like I said, one pair of those available. Those are a new release. Those will be number 34. 34 for those earrings. 
Look at the color of that purple. Oh, it's so gorgeous. I need 34 for those. Hi, Angel. Are you hiding in my room? I am in my room tonight because the boys are out in the living room playing video games. Um, and they get a little worked up. They get a little rowdy, so the language on there. And my phone picks up background noise almost better than what it picks me up talking to you guys. So I wanted to make sure that there was minimum background noise that was going to get picked up on for audio censorship purposes. <laughs> um, and distractions away from the kitties so that way they could have their main playroom out there. Yeah. So we took a break from the kitchen tonight. Thank you. How is your night going, Miss Angel? Okay, so one pair of the purple C La Vie earrings. Again, those were number 34. One pair available of those. Even through the packaging, you can see how purple those are. Woo! Those are so pretty. I'm excited to wear my pair. It's probably what I will do tomorrow. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. Nope! I like my lighting from the kitchen a lot better because I've got like 360 lights all around me so then my ring light catches it more and it doesn't try to do the in and out light adjusting like what it's doing right now. That's why I get John out of the art room. Yeah, I hear you. I've been really tired this week. I think from when I wasn't feeling good last week and then just my lawyer bombarding me with all sorts of stuff again. Just emotionally draining. So, yeah. Yep, I miss my bling room. I cannot wait until we get into our own place and I can get my bling room back. I miss it. I miss my boards. I miss my setup. I miss standing up. <laughs> I get better momentum and stuff when I'm actually standing up and moving around instead of sitting. But we work with it. We, we go along with it. You got your hands full. I do. And they are like non-stop. And Sawyer didn't want to nap. <laughs> so now he's really tired and he's on one and I'm just like daddy can deal with you for a while. <laughs> so Okay, so out of new pieces, that was the last new piece that I had to show you guys for tonight. I might pull out my one set of hair clips, my hair clips though. I'm not sure yet. Okay, so this is a silver and pink necklace. This is a vintage piece. Okay, it's two inch extender, lobster claw hook. These are a, these ones, the silver, see my ring light's messing with me. Yeah, okay. So we have the silver imitation pearl beads on the silver fish hook back. Comes down in with the smaller connector chain and then it comes into large silver hoops. Well, not like large, but medium sized silver hoops. It has the small imitation pearl beads and then it has this m milky, baby pink teardrop style bead that separates and then it goes into the larger silver imitation pearls and those go all the way around the neckline. This is a shorter necklace so on this one is going to sit just like that. Okay. All right. I have one available of these. This is called Pacific Posh. It will be number 19. It is a one and done. So number 19 for that necklace. Number 19. Very pretty necklace. Hopefully it's going to stay positive and it will come to. Oh yes, most definitely. rolling with it because it is what it is. We will get there. We will get there. Next. 
next these this is um, the same necklace this is Pacific posh this is in a multi so this one is again silver and this one is more of a um, like a peach pink color so you have the silver imitation pearls silver fish hook back the silver connecting loops the smaller imitation pearl beads and then see you've got the like peach pink teardrop beads with the mix of the imitation pearl beads so this one's just a little bit darker of a pink so you could say number 19 peach or 19 baby pink if you like either one of those so that one will be number 19 as well okay and you can comment 19 peach or 19 baby pink if you like either one of those He is so ready for bed. So ready for bed. Okay. Up next, this is a blockbuster piece, so this is always available on the website, and we have this in several colors. We have it in black, white, brown, pink, um, and blue. Um, okay. okay, this is called All the Trimmings. I have one available in the pink here, and then I have two available in the brown, and I would have to double check because I don't remember if I sold the blue one or not. I can't remember. Okay, so you have the larger baby pink imitation pearl necklaces that hang from the silver fish hooks, and it's on a ribbon tie. I've seen people wear these as like belts, like side side deco belts. Um, yeah, multiple ways to wear this. Super cute. On the one side you have the silver hoop and it's got the little silver bead that spins in the center. Then you've got the baby pink stone looking bead. The etched design silver pendant there and then it alternates into the pink baby the baby pink imitation pearl it kind of like reminds me of like Saturn the planet Saturn okay and it alternates into that and then it comes down and you have three chains that hang this one has dangles of different baby pink stones and imitation pearls this one is a solid silver chain and this one goes into the pink imitation pearls and the little silver deco beads there. So with that dangles this would be a longer necklace. So on with the ribbon it's going to sit down like that. You can tie it up tighter so it dangles or like I said I've seen people wear them as like deco belts which is really super cute. It's called All the Trimmings. This is a blockbuster piece, so it means that it is one of the top favorites of customers throughout Paparazzi, so they always leave it on stock in the website. So it never sells it never sells out. That one will be number 52. Okay. All the trimmings pink will be number 52. I can show you guys. My brown one. I have two available in the brown. So same necklace, brown ribbon, brown imitation pearls comes down and it's trimmed in the brown imitation pearls. So that's the same necklace just in brown. Okay. So if you like either one of those, you can comment 
number. Oops. What is going on? Do I? There we go. Number 52 brown or 52 pink for either one of those. Okay, these were also a new item that was just released. I have two sets of these available. These are called Polka Dotted Delight. They are cute little flower hair clips with black flower petals with the white center and the black polka dots so it alternates and interchanges with the polka dots. I've got two full sets of these available in the hair. I don't know, they would kind of sit like that. Super adorable. They have the little alligator clip. I have also seen people use these on their heels in summertime, okay, as like a clip to add on to the tops of their heels um, to decorate their shoes up. Or if you've got like wedges and you have the ankle strap that goes around them, you can clip them onto the ankle strap to decorate your shoes a little bit with. So multi-purpose for the little clips as well. It's one thing that I love about our jewelry is all the multifunction um, and like ways that you can wear it and style it. I absolutely love it. So those will be number six for the black polka dotted flower hair clips. Aren't those adorable? Those are way cute. Yep, you could totally use that as a necklace as a belt. Absolutely. Okay, so number six for those hair clips, I've got two sets of those available. So if you have twin girls or not even twins and you just want them to be matching for photos or anything like that, then that's perfect for that where I've got the two sets available. Okay, cute little hair clips. Love those, those are number six. trying to keep an eye on the time because my little man is so tired. He is so tired. Okay, so up next, and I do have two pairs of these earrings as well. These are a vintage earring. These are called Tiki Tassel. They are a silver fish hook earring, rubber backing, very lightweight, very comfortable. Okay, it looks like you got the stones this stack. Okay, and then it comes down into the tassel of brown yarn. Okay, there we go, got it to focus. I was like, come on, man. Okay, those dangle and sit just like that. Super cute, very nice earring for everyday wear. Very simple, not over the top. I have two pairs of those available. Those will be number 47 for the Tiki Tassel in brown. Number 47 for those. Two available. Okay, these
these are also another blockbuster item so they are always available on the website um, they are also available on there in silver I do not have any silver pairs left these are the gold these can be a men's or a women's earring these will be number 40 I have one pair of these available in the gold they are a post earring rubber backing and they have just the large crystal gemstone in the center so regular gemstone gold post earring okay, catches all the light very pretty okay that pair will be number 40 number 40 for that pair And like I said, they are available on my website. They are a blockbuster item, so they always stay in stock, and they are available in silver on there. Okay. These ones are the gold. Up next, this is a copper ring. It's called Bloomin Bloomer. I do have this in blue as well. This will be number 37. This is a stretch band ring. Okay. It looks like the vintage dated copper. Okay. If you need it to fit smaller, you can pop the little toggle off with a pair of needle nose pliers to make it fit smaller. They most of the time fit between a size 6 to 10 comfortably, sometimes an 11. If you need it bigger, you can take a heating element to stretch it out. But you turn it over and it comes into a layer of gorgeous... I think that they would be kind of like a clear moonstone but because of the copper framing they take on the copper tone so you have dozens of layers of the little moonstone crystals there in the color copper tone okay that is that ring very gorgeous ring that's on that finger and that's on the middle finger there okay just like that that's number 37 these work beautiful for scarf ties and also ponytail holders okay that is that gorgeous ring number 37 for it I have one available okay I have these beautiful copper earrings. These will be number 11. They're a fish hook earring, rubber backing. All copper with the floral cutout. Okay. As you can see, they go with a deep red shirt very gorgeously. Okay, that is those. They have a little bit of weight to them, but they are still not super heavy. Okay, very comfortable to wear. Those would look really pretty with that copper ring that I just showed. Okay, those are a one and done. Those will be number 11 for the copper earrings. Number 11. Very pretty earring. I never use.
is to be like a big copper person, but when it's worn with the right shade of clothing, it's beautiful. It, it truly is. Um, so it always pays to like go a little bit outside of like your comfort zone and change styles and textures a little bit and branch out into something new because you might find out that you like it a lot. So those were number 11. Those were a one and done. This one could make a beautiful like multi-layered stuff set if you wanted it to. This is called Blessed is the One Who Trusts. It is a copper bracelet. I have two available. So it says, trust in the Lord. There we go. You can see that etched in the bracelet there. So these would be very cute um, his and hers bracelets. Maybe as kind of like a wedding gift exchange for a new newlywed couple. For a new marriage journey or something okay and that's how that would sit on the wrist I don't have it you can kind of my wrists are tiny but you can kind of pinch it together if you need it to fit snugger okay so that's the copper bracelet that one will be number 91 91 for the trust in the Lord copper bracelet So, 91 for it. Okay. That is just a cuff style bracelet that says trust in the Lord. Number 91, two available of those. paired with this gorgeous copper multi-layered necklace you have the fish hook earring with the copper bead there comes down on the copper chain two inch extender this has multi layers of chains so the first one is just a simple small copper chain the second layer is a large antique looked copper chain and then on the third layer you have another smaller copper chain and it has the stamped copper discs with the multi-sized copper beads in between that dangle off the third chain so on a layer this one sits just like that bit of a different style of necklace there. Okay, that one's going to be number 95. 95 for the triple layer copper necklace. Okay, kind of an up close look at that. Very pretty necklace. Like I said, copper when it's worn with the right style of clothing is very gorgeous and you get some deep denim and you got like a really deep rustic western feel going on. It's perfect. Okay. Okay, so number 95 for that necklace. And 
and I have a copper pair of fish hook earrings here, and they have the iridescent stone in the center. If you wanted an updated earring to make it look just a little bit different and change the look. Okay, one pair available of these. These will be number 66 for those earrings. I like those, those are different and unique. Okay, I like that they have a unique cut to the stone. Okay, and it catches the light, very pretty. Number 66 for those earrings. And then up next, I have this copper short heart necklace. Okay. Fish hook earrings, and you have these stamped out copper hearts, large copper chain, and this one hooks with a toggle hook. Okay. So the way that this necklace goes on is you literally take the little toggle bean and you slip it through the hoop to unlatch or to hook it. Okay. And then that sits at the top of the copper heart charm that dangles at the bottom. This is a shorter necklace, so on it would sit just about like so. Very cute. This would be another pretty one for a Valentine's Day gift. Okay, this one will be number 21. 21 for the copper heart charm necklace okay number 21 for that okay one available of it it is a one and done vintage necklace very pretty necklace number 21 for it And then if you like our statement inspirational pieces, okay. this is a short little copper necklace, dainty copper necklace. This is Own Your Journey. We have the famous tassel paparazzi earrings in copper on the, on the fish hook. Okay, you have the lobster claw hook, two inch extender, dainty copper chain, and then at the end you have the copper pendant, and on it it says own your journey. So on it would sit just like that, very dainty simple necklace, inspirational piece there. Okay. That is a one and done as well. So that one will be number 20. Number 20 for the Own Your Journey Copper Necklace. That is a vintage piece. Number 20 for that. I have one available.
Up next, I have a large bright copper floral ring. This is called Tropical Gardens. It is another stretch band ring. Large, bright, shiny copper flower. Okay, so clip on that finger, or you can wear it in the center. Okay. That ring will be number 84 for the copper flower ring. Number 84. Very shiny and pretty. Okay. If you would like something to pair with that, I have this gorgeous, same kind of shiny copper. Colored cuff bracelet. This is called Modest Goddess. Okay. It would match that ring perfectly if you would like to turn that into a set. This is a cuff style bracelet. So it literally just cuffs on. And that's how it sits. Okay. And you just have multi layers of crossing metal. Okay. I have one available of that bracelet that will be number 78 78 for the modest goddess copper bracelet one available of it okay. and again that's number 78 For that bracelet number 78 okay one available of it for my copper pieces. Up next, I have these large brass hoop earrings. They almost look like they were um, stamped, kind of look like they would be almost leopard spotted. Okay. So, large hoop. This is a brass hoop it is a post earring with the metal post backs okay that's the stamping that's on it okay large brass hoop earring I have one of those available those will be number 83 number 83 for those I have one available in those okay number 83 for those you guys are all having a fantastic evening I appreciate everybody joining in with me again um, for those of you who know and those of you who don't my name is Julia you're turning tuning into Wild Prairie Bling I am an independent consultant with paparazzi I am coming up on my third pop anniversary in May super excited about that um, I am showing adult pieces tonight that are all five dollars I do invoicing on Sundays as I do multiple lives per week, and I do shipping on Mondays um, as long as the post office is open and invoices are paid. 
Invoices are due immediately on Sunday when I send them out. That way I can do shipping on Mondays. Everything is tax free. All the pieces are lead and nickel free. During the live, you will see number cards with the pieces. And if I'm live and you'd like to claim anything, you can just comment the number that I show with the piece. If you come back and watch the replay, the numbers will not be with the pieces after I show them tonight. Um, so if there's something you like, you can just screenshot it and send me a picture of it and I can get that marked down for you. Okay, so up next we have a bangle brass bracelet. This is called the Big Bangle. So these are just, it's sold as one bracelet, but you got multi-layers of bangles. You have the flat brass, you have like the stamped brass and an etched brass bracelet, and they just sit along the wrist like this. Gold brass bracelet. It is a vintage piece that is a one and done. That'll be number 33. Number 33 for the bingo bracelet. Okay. Number 33. I have one available in it. So that is a one and done. Number 33 for that. Next, oh, is this a copper? Oh, yep, I did have another copper necklace that snuck in there. Okay, this is a vintage necklace as well. This is a one and done. This is a long necklace. You can loop it to double layer it if you want. Copper fish hook earrings, and you have the copper hoops there. And it's like a rustic copper. Okay long copper chain and then it comes down into the multiple sized and shaped copper rings all down the chain so again that is a long piece so that sits right above the belly button you could double layer it and wear it layered to get a shorter stacked look Or you could pair um, a shorter copper necklace with it to where it would dangle in the center of this one and leave this one long. That's always fun to layer your necklaces like that. I like layering necklaces. So this is a one and done. This one will be number 45 for the long. Copper necklace number 45 for that piece. Number 45, one available. This is called Perfect Mismatch.
Okay. This is a short brass necklace. This is called Glimmer Takes All. It is a double layer necklace. You have the brass fish hooks with the brass imitation pearl earring. Double brass chain lobster claw hook, two inch extender. On the first one, you have the oval brass rings with the brass beads on each side. And then this one switches to where you have the brass rings on the side with the brass beads in the center. So it lays just like that. This is a double layer. So on, it's going to fit and sit just about like that. Again, that one's called Glimmer Takes All. It is a one and done. This one will be number 23. Number 23 for that brass necklace. Very pretty brass necklace. Number 23 for that one. One available. And then I have these brass earrings that are called Mirror Mirror. Okay. Fish hook earring on brass. Rectangle design. Okay, and then you have the brass rhinestones that go all around the frame with the hollow center. Those are called mirror mirror. Those are a one and done as well. Those are a vintage brass earring. Okay, these will be number 46. Mm. Number 46 for the mirror mirror earrings. Okay, one pair available of those. And then I have this another short brass necklace. This is called In Full Orbit. This one's really cute. Okay. You have the brass fish hook with these simple brass circular earring, double brass chain, lobster claw hook, two inch extender. Okay. That chain's double looped through there to hold. Comes down to the brass rings there and then you have all of the brass rings and they kind of get thicker in the frame as they go down the neckline 
and then the little small brass hoops sit on the inner. Okay, so on this one is going to sit just like that. Okay, that one's cute. Okay, this one will be number 81. It is a vintage necklace, it's a one and done. So number 81 for the in full orbit necklace. Okay, number 81 for that. I've got one available. I like that necklace. It's a lot. Okay, it's very cute. These are called Alpha Amazon. They are a brass fish hook earring with the rubber backings. Very lightweight. And they have that kind of like Aztec Amazon cut out, stamped out design in it with the teardrop shaped earring. Okay. Those would sit just like that. Those are a one and done as well. Those will be number nine. Number nine for the Alpha Amazon earrings. One pair available of those. Those are number nine. Those are really cute too. Number nine for those. And then up next I have this brass necklace. It's called Bragging Rights. It is a shorter necklace. Okay. Fish hook style earring and you have the honeycomb brass teardrop bead there. Brass brass chain and then it comes down oh, all the tassels have gone like crazy from being in the package eh. try to get those to dangle the right way here okay so you have the same matching brass teardrop bead and then you have the brass tassel chains that hang behind there. So on this piece is going to sit just like that. Okay. It's a very pretty brass necklace there. Again, that one's called bragging rights. That one is a one and done as well. This one is number 16. Number 16 for that brass necklace. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous the way that that lays? Yeah, so pretty. Okay, number 16 for that. I have one available of it. Okay. I'd play with the tassels all day long. <laughs> My one year old would like the tassels.
last for this evening, but of course not least. This is a longer brass necklace. This is a vintage necklace. It is a one and done. This is called Hunt or Be Hunted. It never likes to come out of the bag. The famous paparazzi tassel earrings in the brass. Long, dainty brass chain. And you come down and it has this brass medallion with the tassels that dangle here. And of course they're wrapped. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So you have kind of like the arrowhead triangle and it's got a bunch of the like pressed markings in it and then it comes down into like that crescent with all the tassels that dangle off of the bottom of it. Okay so again this is a longer necklace so it will sit right above the belly button. It's so long you can't even on if you wanted to layer it to where you could wear it shorter it would sit just like that okay and dingle just like so that is a one and done And this one will be number 48 and this is the last piece of the night that I'm showing so that long brass tassel necklace will be number 48 okay, number 48 for that one one available of it Again, if you catch the replay and there's anything that you like, just go ahead and screenshot it and send it to me in a message. I am getting ready to also revamp so I can again invoice through Square as well and not just PayPal. I also have my YouTube channel now and a my Pinterest page so um, I'll be sharing the links to those over the next couple of days if you guys would like to go support those it's a good place to catch my videos on a replay as well all right I appreciate you guys tuning in and hanging out with me for a while this evening I hope you guys had a fantastic Wednesday and I will be back again tomorrow night with some more pieces to show you guys hope you all have a great night Thank you, guys.